part of Flower Power for Redcar and we need the people's millions money so that we can build a bandstand here on our seafront. When the movie Atonement was filmed in Redcar last year, there was a great buzz about the town and one of the last parts of the film set to be dismantled was the bandstand and everybody was really sad to see it go and wanted to know if we could have a permanent one. We already have a great beach, so how great would it be to bring the kids down to the beach and listen to a free concert, and at the same time, local performers or performers from outside of the area could come to Redcar and use the bandstand as a showcase for their talent. And there are bandstands around the area, but we haven't had one in Redcar for over 40 years. And uh, people have happy memories about Redcar bandstand, and it's great. It's a fantastic thing for Redcar. When I saw a tournament and there was a bandstand there, I thought, oh, our bandstand, yes. We lost ours, I wish we had another one. Children are really, really enthusiastic about performing outside of school. There's a lack of performance areas in, in Red Car and the surrounding area, and it would just be brilliant for them if they could um, perform outside, and uh, it would really swell their confidence. It would be good to go to it and listen to the music because it sort of inspires you in a way. If we've got a bandstand it might attract some, some musicians to come play here and put us on the map a little bit. from West Middlesbrough Neighbourhood Trust and I'd like to show you why we're wild about Winnie Banks and why we think we deserve the people's millions to turn this into a natural play area and wildlife haven for local communities and school children. As you can see, the pond currently is in a really bad state. What we aim to do is to do some sympathetic management works of the surrounding habitat, take some of it back to create this open landscaped area where we're hoping to put a two metre recycled plastic pond dipping platform so the children will be able to come right out into the pond and actually be able to see what's in there as well as doing the footpaths which will be widened quite considerably because currently they're not safe footpaths for anybody who has any kind of mobility issues um, particularly those who are in wheelchairs. We've got a pond here on the carpet. A lot of the children that we've got here, they live in, in houses without gardens or very small gardens. They don't have space for ponds. The opportunity to go somewhere really local that we can go to, we can walk there, um, so the children can see the animals for themselves, just be out of this world for them. I'd like to see a frog in a new pond. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I would like to see the snail at the pond. As you can see at the moment, there's absolutely no way any family would be able to bring their children down to this pond to be able to enjoy a picnic or anything like that. But the People's Millions, we hope to change that and make this pond an accessible community asset. We all stand together. This project is really important to our community, so please, please give us your vote because... Here's how you can vote. For Bandstand for Red Car, call 08702 434 201. Or for Wild About Winnie Banks, call 08702 434 202.